Hello traders, welcome to KineFX Academy YouTube channel. My name is Akin Lakin, I'm the lead instructor. So guys, here is another beautiful and simple, powerful strategy to scalp boom and crash. You understand? You can see on my screen that on the indicator window, we have some lines. First of all, let me explain those lines. You understand? So these three lines, the green ones, they are the Bollinger Bounds. You understand? The black and the red one is just Mofe, Nafrich, and the Magdi. You understand? So, how does this Bollinger Bounds and the Magdi and the Mofe, Nafrich come up to give us a good scalping strategy? This strategy is very effective. You understand? So, we are going to do some back testing together now to confirm the strategy is very effective the one good thing about this strategy is that it doesn't have much confidence to follow like it doesn't have much rules the rule is just that once you see that this moving average first of all it must crosses a spike must happen in the market that will make this moving average to cross the third the three bollinger bands you understand the eye you know we have three band the upper band middle band and the lower band now when you are trading boom your focus should be on the upper band the price must crosses the upper band which is the moving average and the mark thing the red and the black line should cross the upper band you understand so what are you waiting for on the upper band you want the crossing to also happen at the upper band without crosses the upper band once you see that you enter for sale you count your five to ten candles you understand so you can see that here the crosses happen above the upper band you enter for the trade from here if you enter for sale from here you have your 10 candle complete so now let's go back and see if there is any other signal we can look at you understand so you can see here the crosses also happened here you will have count your 10 candles or 5 to 10 candles from here 5 to 10 it depends if you are trading small accounts use 5 candles if your account is above um maybe it's up to 1500 you can use 10 you understand so there's one thing I want to explain. You can see this cross in here now. This signal is invalid. You understand? It's invalid because the cross is happen, but it's happen below the Bollinger bands. You understand? You can see it's even happen below the second band. So the strategy is invalid. So this is a valid strategy, a signal, you understand? So you love enter, you count your five candle, exit the trade. There's one good thing about this strategy is that if it gives you signal and a spike happen, the spike is not going to affect you that much. You understand? You can see this signal now. This signal is invalid. You understand the reason why it's invalid is that the third band is still above if you draw your screen you will see that you still have one band above those crossing you understand there is no 100 percent strategy you understand so it's possible you have a 10 signals and eight is correct two is wrong or seven is correct three is wrong it's still possible it's still a good strategy if you have that you understand if you have a seven percent accurate strategy is a good one that is out of 10 trade 77 is right three is wrong there is no hundred you can't have 10 10 never you can't have you can't have you understand so let's share crash let's see how this strategy work on crash now we should be looking at the lower band now lower band so the crosses should happen below the lower band then you buy five to ten candle the strategy is very very effective you understand you can see it's good for boom and crash one thousand 
take note of that boom and crash one thousand one thousand one thousand so it's not that effective on 500 and 300 markets so i will advise you if you are trading smart and just stick to the one thousand you understand so just follow the simple instruction add it okay fine let me show you the settings before i end the video so we don't have anything on the main chart on the indicator window the macd is 13.219 so apply to close choose any color of your choice here the second one is bollinger band the period is 200 the revision is 1.500 shift is zero apply to first indicators data which is the macd data you understand click on save after that then the last one is the moving average period to shift to zero enter the exponential apply to first indicator that's again the macd so after that click on save so you should have that if you have this on your chart if you add it correctly so follow the instruction i've explained so far go your demo account to back test um to demo trade and confirm how effective these strategies are I wish happy trading and always stay responsible. Thank you.